In this question, we're looking for the limit as x goes to infinity of a quadratic over a linear expression. Well, we see that we can factor x squared out of the numerator and x out of the denominator. Uh, so we choose the lower degree of those two options. We're going to factor x out of both numerator and denominator, leaving us in the numerator with a second factor of 4x plus 8 minus 1 over x and in the denominator of 3 plus 5 over x. If you're not sure why that is, imagine um, distributing that x term into each of these brackets and you would get what we originally started with. Now this may seem a little odd, but this is how we approach uh, questions, uh, limits as x goes to infinity. What we then have in the numerator is 4x plus 8 minus 1 over x and in the denominator is 3 plus 5 over x. Well, we treat these limits individually, and we see that this 1 over x term uh, ultimately grows infinitely close to 0, and this 5 over x term ultimately becomes infinitely close to 0. So we have the limit as x goes to infinity of 4x plus 8 over 3. Now, this has been simplified a bit, and we see that what we have is a numerator that's growing without bound and a denominator that's constant. When you have a numerator growing without bound and a denominator that's constant, the limit doesn't exist, or we can say the limit is equal to infinity.